Okay, so uh, welcome back. I was not expecting to come back quite this soon. I was expecting 2024 to be sure, but you know, today, yesterday, I'm not sure. It's pretty early in the morning. The, you know, new DLC came out and I thought, okay, let's uh, jump straight in. I mean, for me, it's personally been a couple of, a uh, couple of, no, not a couple of weeks. I was going to say months. It's not been quite that long since I finished the game. And for you, I don't believe I've actually finished posting the episodes yet. So, you know, I guess I'll just continue it a little bit further with the DLC. Echoes of the Fallen. A whole new quest line separate from the main scenario. New characters to meet and new areas to explore. New weapons and gear and two redeemable bonus items which include the buster sword from i believe final fantasy 7 it's either 7 or 8 and i believe 8 is the gun sword the gun blade the blade gun i don't know what it's called and i think the buster sword is the big ass one right uh, a new level cap so we've got um the DLC has increased Clive's level cap by five for all play gameplay modes, so we can get to a hundred and five. And uh, uh, yeah, so we'll uh, go purchase that, and I'll meet you in the game. Or oh, I'll go purchase that, and I'll meet you in the game. Wow, I can't talk tonight. Okay, so here we are, and I see our beautiful little uh, purple mark. This took me longer than I expected it would, but we are finally here. Uh, first of all, we need to go to our system. I think it's the chest here, right? Oh, I've got quite a few that I've not done yet. Actually, I, I've got two that I've just got and then one that I've not noticed. Apparently, I've got an onion sword. Nice. So, what does, what does it look like? We'll have to have a look. Let's, uh, let's quickly uh, pop ourselves onto the stone. Appearances. Armor. So that's Ragnarok. Uh, what are we looking at? The onion sword looks nice, actually. There we go. Just our man with the buster sword. Nice. Uh, let me... I'm like, do I really want to talk to him? Yes, I want to talk to this. Get rid of it. Where's, where's our new thing? I cannot tell. I've forgotten what it was called. I'll recognise it when I see it. Oh, I like it. Should have that on all the time. Hello. Is something the matter, Karen? You seem Tell me about what's perturbed. happening. Do I now? How clever of you to notice. But yes, something's come to my attention. <sighs> and I would be damned if I'm not I love it. I love it. It's like you seem perturbed. And in the background it's do 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 you know, like you know, I, I don't know how to explain music. But it's not the music that should be playing. It's not calm and solemn. It's life of the party music. So tell me about your concern, my dear. It's probably <laughs> and then it just gets just higher, the, uh, louder. The, uh, Ooh. Some sort of crystal. Oh, I don't remember seeing one that colour before. Aye, well, that makes two of us. And if she hasn't seen it, trading, then both over and Oof. under the counter, I've never seen anything quite like it. They call in them dusk crystals on account of colour. Yeah. I see. They can be used to cast magics. That they can. Just like their brighter, shinier cousins. Differences. 
they don't last as long. After a couple of goes light in your pie, they crumble away to nothing. Okay, so not good then. That's how I heard about them. Front crystal traders moaning that someone's been flooding the market with dodgy goods. And after asking the right people the right questions, and paying the right price, of course, I managed to get my hands on a sample. Sounds this like something we'll tired. have to deal with. I hope. Do you feel that? Oh, right? what the hell's happening? Yes. An earthquake? The world's just being destroyed, isn't it? Just, you know, <laughs> technically in this game, we've not quite finished. Origin, so it's still like a giant crystal up in the air. And we've got this new thing that's going on. Okay, these guys must be the ones that are taking them then. Look at you with your fancy scarf. All right, lads, that'll do for today. I said that'll do for today. Yes, Chief. Yes, Chief. Let's get this lot back to town, fill our purses, and then so our are bellies. These good guys? Or are these just people trying to scam people off the... What did you two do now? <laughs> you were watching them the entire time. They did nothing. Oh, you dropped your... Your, your torch. Please tell us you bought another lantern. Stay calm, both of you. It looks like they're in like the ash, ashy area. Don't use that. Who needs a lantern when you've got one of these? for a single spark. Well, there'll be no more sampling the merchandise today. Oh, something in there. Run, fellas. That sounded close, Chief. Really close. Really, really close. Now, lads, what am I always telling you? Good things come to those who run? <laughs> Wait for us, Chief! <laughs> I don't know why I wasn't, I wasn't expecting... Oh my god, what is that? Echoes of the Fallen. Okay, whoever that is, I kind of low-key love him. Oh, I, I need to see what he looks like without the fucking cloak. But I fancied the scarf, and uh, that that was funny. That's my sort of guy. Oh, is shit going down? It's time to run for it. I've never felt a tremor this far inland before. <laughs> Me neither. But then, I'd never seen skies like these till a few moons ago, and it's been all change ever since. Come to think of it, the first anyone ever heard of these dust crystals was after you lot came back from the Dominion. Ah, so it might be us that have affected it. Do you think the two things are connected? Who knows? Could just be that with Drake's tail gone, the black market was running short of the good stuff. The Dominion's mines were the only source of new shards left in storm after a certain evil outlaw decided to do away with the other mothers. Yeah, that's what we do. And with the price of decent crystals going through the roof, traders turned to dealing in stuff they'd never have touched before. The question is, who's selling these crystals and where are they? Wait. This colour. They couldn't be from... Origin, How would they? they get to origin? No, that wouldn't make sense. I saw it form in the sky, and that was long after we returned from the Dominion. But if they didn't come from origin or any of the other mother crystals, then... What does that mean? That you missed one. Mm. Oh, yeah. That were my thinking, any road. 
Another mother crystal we didn't know about. I'll speak with Joshua. If you're right about this, we need to find it. And quick, I'd say. On account of which, I'll take this shard over to Tom's for you. Thank you. Get him to give it a once over, case it rings any bells. Right. Thank you. And I expect you'll be wanting Jill's help with this too. I love my brother and my. I, I was gonna say sister. Oh my god, that was my sister. Ooh, fancy music. And now that we've gone from a cutscene away from the place, notice how the music has uh, changed. How have I already got a uh, thingy? Brave the dusk. I've not braved anything yet. Quest destinations for Echoes of the Fallen are indicated with a purple mark. After accepting the current objective, uh, these will temporarily replace the main scenario objectives. If you wish to restore main scenario objectives to the do, do list, you can do so on the journal tab. Okay. Look at my boy. It's just waiting calmly for me to join them. How are you guys doing? Oh, and there's my other boy just staring out into the sea. But anyway, you guys, hello. Joshua, we need to talk. Karen's caught wind of something that I don't think we can afford to ignore. And then, why couldn't you have just, like, joined us? Instead of we had Fate of Black to tell the story that happened, like, five minutes ago. Hi. That is troubling. Just a Not little bit. because the Undying made no mention of these dust crystals in any of their recent reports. So they weren't aware of them either? Well, perhaps. Or perhaps they merely deemed them unworthy of my attention. Uh, wrongly, I might add. For I am inclined to share Lady Karen's misgivings. Then we'd better take her advice and consult Hippocrates forthwith. Yes, that's to the always our go-to. With our combined insight, I'm sure we'll discern something of use, be it no more than a place to start. Let's hope so. Are we at least cutting to him? Yes. Good. There you are. I've taken the liberty of telling these two everything I told you. Thank you, Karen. It's hard to believe such a lusterless shard could conjure much of anything. And you truly think this came from a mother crystal? One we never knew existed? Every other shard in the twins did. Why should these dusk crystals be any different? Dim though they may be. We know they first appeared on the black market shortly after Ultima Car's primogenesis, darkening the skies. So might the two be connected? Could the spell have created a new mother crystal, perhaps? A replacement for the ones we destroyed? I mean, what do you think, how many did we destroy? I think there may well be a connection. Yet, if we are to believe that the original mother crystals were of Ultima's making, does it seem likely that he would have need of anything so palpably inferior? No. I hazard that it was not Ultima who created these crystals, but humanity. More specifically, our fallen forebears, whose wonders litter the land even Oh, now. yeah, that makes sense. That Legend makes sense. That the fallen challenged the gods in order to win their power, and came tantalizingly close to doing so. It seems only reasonable that they should wish to learn the secrets of the crystals which the gods bestowed upon them. So they could make their own. Precisely. You may recall that the tale of the sins of Zemeckis begins with the colloquy of the sages, a council wherein humanity sought to uncover the last secrets of the gods before waging their war to learn what little remained. It is perfectly possible that an understanding of how to craft crystals was among their many achievements. Among their many achievements prior to their fall. <laughs> Indeed. The same enlightened souls forged great okay okay you guys are just going with that to derive their name and turned them against each other in the magitech war a pointless conflict which served only to make its victors more confident of their right to supplant the gods on high and when at last they ventured to do so the resultant imbalance in the ether is said to have been so great that the skies themselves turned black and began to boil 
the first recorded RK sky, I suspect. Which brings us back to the matter at hand. It is my belief that these shards are the product of a long slumbering Magitek mother crystal, stirred to life by a similar etheric upheaval to the one which accompanied its creator's fall. There's only one way to know for sure. We track down whoever's selling them and find their source. Karen, where did you buy this one? Down in Port Isolde when I was scratching around well, for I guess supplies. that's where we'll need to uh, Since go the next. Since Imperials buggered off and took the tariffs with him, you can find all sorts of interesting stuff on the docks. Go and have a chat with the mercenaries guarding the gates. I will. Your uncle's got some good lads there. I will have you a know chat. Know when to keep a watchful eye and when to turn a blind one. Oh, and take the crystal with you. Might be your key to the underworld. Thank you. I will. Shall we then, brother? I'm coming too. If there is I mean, you guys call me around all the time like anyway, so... You'll need all the help you can get. I was hoping you'd say that. One more time then. Together. You say that as if there's not another DLC coming out. Oh, my sweet child. <laughs> just, just a very uh, slightly emotional scene and I come back and it's just this music. It's beautiful. I love it. Let's get out of here. Who's chasing them? Grab him. Grab him. Why would you not grab him? Fuck me. They're fast on their feet. What's going on here, I wonder? What indeed? Let's go ask. Let's ask. Yep. I'm with you. For a minute you were looking at my dog, but you're just looking at the floor. What was what was happening, okay? Okay, so let's continue. Let's proceed. Excuse me. Who were those men just What now? were they up to? Bloody troublemakers, that's who. As soon as I asked them to present their packs for inspection, they turned white as a sheet and legged it. I chased them all the way from the gates, but they're swift as hares. Okay. Still, at least we kept the bastards out. Don't need their kind stirring up any more strife. And what manner of strife have they been stirring up exactly? I mean, we don't know for sure. Are you joking? Uh. This business with the crystals. Sorry, we've been away for a while. What's been going on? The crystals. All right, I'll humor you. <laughs> After the paltry rations the Imperials left behind dried up, folks started trading crystals out in the open. We turned a blind eye at first, followed Byron's orders. Oh, well, thank were right you, the night thank you, Uncle. They were all clamoring for, till the dust started turning up. That is, dusk crystals they're called. Ill-favored shards that crack as soon as you look at them. Not that the folk who bought them by the bucket load knew that, and they were baying for blood when they found well, out. They should have waited. Yeah, they shouldn't have bought a lot of them. Yeah, and ban the blasted thing. And we've been searching the pack of every trader who's darkened our gates ever since. I see. And you think the men you were pursuing might have been trading in these dusk crystals? Why? You're in the market for some. Anyway, I wouldn't no, rule it we, out. Yeah, uh, we already have Fact, them, thank I've you. Got a few gill on it. We might still be able to catch them. We might. If you are heading up that way, you'll want to keep your sword handy. It's more than dodgy traders plying the ropes these days. Understood. Understood. Be careful. I need to talk to these guys. They were so funny. If those men were selling dusk crystals, 
I think it's unlikely that they will risk returning to Portus Orbit. Not for now. Which means this might be our only chance of catching them. Well, they definitely run quite a distance. Where are we going? Yeah, they've run quite a while. We'll have to, uh, let's get on the chocobos and catch up to them, eh? Still some distance ahead, I'd wager. So we're making great pace. There's too many people here. I gotta do some of this. Alright, fellas. I don't know why I'm doing this just for you, but uh yeah. Do these guys really need Mega Fly? No. But uh we'll do some of it anyway. There we go. Genuinely did not need to do that, but they'll definitely see me come in now, eh? <laughs> What's that? What's that? Beams of light in the distance. Oh, that'd be me. Still no sign of those traders, though. They've got to be around here somewhere, right? They can't have gotten that far. I just hope we haven't lost them. Checking some of the caravans. These blimmin' tremors are scaring off all our customers. <laughs> the few that weren't scared off by the skies, you mean? Yeah, that is what he yeah. means. Perhaps one of those merchants has seen something. Hello, Forgive good me. sirs. But did you happen to see three men in robes pass this way? Yeah, I seen them. Poor bastards. What do you mean? What do you mean? A gang of nasty looking brutes was on their trail. Caught up with them just up the road. Screaming at them they were. Your crystals are your lives and all that. Only the daft buggers kept their crystals and legged it. it did. In which direction, out of interest? Up that way. Well then, thank you. Towards the old hill docks. If it's help they seek there, they won't find any. But perhaps they might find a place to hide. Let's hope so. And then we can find them before their pursuers do. Thank you. And please, take care on the road. Let's Come go. On. They're no good to us dead. They're Lead not. The way, brother. But still. Could we move a little bit faster, please? No, thank you. No, thank you. No fight on the way. I want to get there and be done with it. So the bandits haven't found them either. There's still time. We've got to search for the traders, do we? Okay. Open up. Okay, they're not there. Oh, do I have to kill these guys? Okay. Bad luck. Okay. Right. Let's focus on finding the traders. I mean. Why can't we just get rid of them all and then we d we don't need to worry about them? You know what I mean? But fine, I get told off. They're not being quiet to all these guys. Oh, he's, he's wearing... Was he wearing that colour the first time? Uh, this should be far enough. I don't think so. <sighs> Got a fancy coat on uh, now, though. Chief, they've found us. 
It's getting so a man can't even catch his fucking breath. Gentlemen, a word. We understand you've been selling some crystal. And like I told you, thieving mates, you're not fucking getting them. <coughs> so you can take your massive sword and <laughs> shove it. I am wearing the best I'm sure sword. I could, but we're not thieves. Over here. See, we should have taken them out on the way through. Um, if you've got a plan, you see. Tell us you've got a plan. Of course I've got a bloody plan. Good things and all that. But he's gonna get us to do his dirty work. Let's start again, shall we? You say you're interested in the crystals. I'm interested trade? in where you got those crystals from. Not exactly. In actual fact, we were hoping to talk about this. Is that all? Well, then I know just how to help. If I defeat those guys and I turn back and you're sword, gone. Shifter, he's over here! Are you mad? <sighs> Sweetie, that was the worst mistake you could have made. And I look forward Slippery to showing you why. Little pricks. Clinkers on the ground. Quick as you like. Gentlemen, you've got it all wrong. Do we look like merchants? Yes. He's the one you want. Just look at what he's got in his hand. What? Him? Wait, I'm not. Does it matter, Clive? We'll just fight them. Do let us know if you need any more help. <laughs> okay, I still like him, but he's still getting a punch to the mouth. No. Well, they'll wish they oh, they'll wish they had. Beautiful. Uh, yeah. to think of him. Ow! That was just rude of you. Um, scared a bit of hot cup here. You guys didn't seem to enjoy the cold. There we go, easy enough. And we've got useless in, uh, items as well. Did you see which way they went? They went across the bridge. North, making for three reeds at a guess. We'll have to follow them. After them. If they reach the swamps, we'll never pick up their trail. Was there a quick way to go? No. Okay. So we'll just go across the solar wires. There was something odd about those three. They seem less like merchants and more like charlatans. One might argue that a merchant is naught but a mama without his mop. Then why am I not amused? <laughs> Oh, it's alright, it's alright Death Bottom, we don't want to fight you, so uh, never mind, there we go. <laughs> I was like, yeah, let me continue the fight, but the fight was over and I was like, oh no, 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 no. I don't want to fight the big horn, thank you. We'll crawl through the bushes to avoid him. I love the guy, but not today. Where's the gun now? What did he find, boy? He didn't find anything. I found them. You found them. Clive, judging by the state of the ground, a lot more passed this way than our three charlatans. Another group of bandits. Hmm. I doubt they'd leave this crystal behind. Regardless, we're on the right track. Let's pick up the pace. Let's pick up the pace. Let's run for it, fellas. I don't know why I called both Jill and my brother fellas, but yes. 
Go away, please. They wouldn't risk stopping at Martha's rest, would they? Not if they hope to pass unnoticed. Then we'd better stick to the swamps. We head in this way, won't we? Well, okay, there's nothing there. What am I looking at here? Right, I don't know why I went that way. Should just look at the map, but I didn't. Let's uh, head this way. See if we can find the guys. Company. I see them over there, yeah. I could fight them, but it's like... I hate to be the breaker of bad news, boys. Fuck. Hi. Bastards, I'll give them that. Friends, I knew those louts were no match for you. Uh huh. But of course you did, because you know what we're capable of, don't you? <laughs> no. You deal in crystal. Dusk crystal, and we want to know where you got it. So you're going to tell us? Let's assume for a moment that we are the merchants you're looking for. Okay, you are. Why would we tell you where we procure our stock? What kind of shepherd leads a wolf straight to the <laughs> wolf? Oh. Oh. Are they getting worse? Oh, what the fuck is that? Clive, the tower. I'm guessing that's where you got it from. Hmm? Oh, that's new. That's impossible. Yeah, Chief. Do you think someone else got into the tower? Why are you that sort? And what would they find there if they did? Probably the uh, the I, I the, the machine I've never pistol. Been there. Echoes maybe, or fallen rubbish. I really couldn't say. The entrance is sealed tight. No way in. Oh. How will you know that if you've never been there? Everybody wants to have a look I, at the tower. Uh... Look behind you, an Akashic monster. If you think I'm going to fall for another one of your cheap tricks, Clyde, trouble. Yeah, it's like there's four of us. The four of us. One of us could at least look behind us. If you guys run away again, I'll be bloody pissed. Stay where you are. Wait, don't you dare. Could one of you go after them? Could one of you go after them, though? I can deal with this thing by myself. Probably the tower, yeah. I didn't do it right, never mind. There's a thing where you can like use an attack while it's happening, but I forgot to do the attack before I started it. Oh. 
I probably took longer than it usually does, but I'm having I'm having fun with my new my new guy. I've decided to get rid of Titan for now. So we've got uh Bahamut. Well, that actually, was it Bahamut that I liked? I well, think it was actually uh, Odin. <laughs> Oops. That's twice we've and twice they've been away. Next time I say we just, you know, handcuff them to ourselves. That'll stop this this business. You all right, man? I I don't see anyone. I've had enough of bandits and beasts, Chief. Can't we just go home? You can go home. And let those thieving pricks march in and take what's ours? What's ours? Oh, no, no, no. You don't mean the Dusk Crystal's eye. Halleck? Malik? We're going back to that tower if it's the last thing we do. But the lights, Chief. What about the lights? First you whine about it being too dark, then you whine about it being too light. Think about how easy it'll be to mine now. I feel like it'd be harder because something's clearly put the tower on. If he dies, it's his own darn fault. Let's be real. And you're sure they're bound for the tower? And they aren't running away from trouble, they're running towards it. Do you know anything of the place, Joshua? Last not. I have seen it labelled Sage Spire on some maps, but beyond that, no the thing. ruins are no different from any other fallen derelict. Another impenetrable relic of the past. Not so impenetrable, apparently. Our friends plainly found a way in. They did. They could be living there, like we do in the Invincible. Well, the tower is unquestionably large enough to hide three merchants. But is it large enough to hide what we seek? We don't know how big a it mother is. Crystal. It would go some way to explain why the area was among the first in Rosaria to fall to the blight. Then it's settled. And, you know, however and make our approach from the superior dim. the technology that they had is, the fact of the matter is, you know, they wouldn't have been able to create a completely a big one, in would they? All this time. The wars that could have been avoided. We still don't know what's in there, Clive. But whatever it is, there is a good reason it has gone unnoticed for so long. Yep. The tower sits atop a jagged ridge. Few have ever had occasion to pick their way through the rocks, even before the blight swallowed them. Okay. That sounds, uh, sounds difficult to aim. Let's uh, head that way then. God, this place is just terrible to look at, isn't it? It's just completely destroyed. And yeah, it would make sense why there's no, um... Oh, okay. Took away control. It would make sense why the blight did hit here. Are those... goblins? What are they doing in the Deadlands? They found something? Maybe? Are they the ones that are in the spire? That have taken control of it? I don't recall ever hearing of goblins using fallen relics as weapons. Well, I think they'll pick up anything. Gifts. Anything that they can use. Remember where we are. No magic. Right. Oh. No magic at all. That's weird. That's the real. I can't remember actually fighting at all in this, like, Deadland area. So it, it makes sense. Cool. I've got that guy, don't worry about it. Let's get somebody, uh... It was impressive. I can't even move to somebody. Weird. Definitely fascinating. 
I don't know why I'm like, I'm so like, wow about that. Let's hope that was the last one. Hopefully it was. Indeed. I'd almost forgotten what it was like to have to rely on steel alone. Did you ever have to rely on steel alone? Hi. Joe. I mean, I don't know when you were black. You may want to see this. You had it a while ago, right? I mean, you could have just what? taken me around here. Ooh, is the door, is that open? It looks like it's open. Into the deep, dark depths. It was open when I found it. Someone was in a hurry. Three guesses as to who. Then this must be their way into the tower. Then we must There's follow them. to find out. Let's go. Yeah, so we're gonna head to the tower. It looks definitely bigger than if this is the like entrance. The only way is up into the spire. Oh, we've definitely done that, haven't we? Yep. So in mountainous silence, do wintered spectres watch from on high, ever reminding us how far we have climbed, how far we have fallen. Oh, this is beautiful to look at. It's like an entire city you could just live here. Seems somebody's woken this place up. The question is, yeah. Who? who? Well, I can tell you who it wasn't. Unauthorized biometrics detected. Someone's here. Initializing security scan. That's Safety an AI. That's an AI. I don't think that was someone, Clive. I think it was the tower. Either way. Sound like we're welcome. Keep your guard up. Oh, look at that superhero pose. Beautiful. And I like the, uh, I like the pattern around the door. Gives me a very Stargate feel. <laughs> okay. So I guess, well, best case scenario is to probably always head up. Intruder. Oh, and luckily we've got magic back. Yay! I think my powers have returned. You? I think. There's ether here. An abundance of it. That's interesting. That they've somehow managed to, like, even in the middle of the blighted area, they've still got enough ether to, like, make this place still magical. Did I come from that way? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I've already lost the direction that I was going. Oh, we got more fighting. You know I like my uh, cold snap. Yeah, 
you heard me. Stay down. An escapement bit. Oh, that's weird. Half flame. Some opponents will cast a spell half flame to summon a magic spear that protects a nearby ally, dealing damage to any who come in contact with it. Enemies accompanied by a half flame can be identified by the icon above their heads. The spear can be dispelled by attacking it, but be warned melee strikes to the spear will deal Clive damage, so range spells are recommended. More problems. Work with me here. There we go. Oh, there's one left. Hey, fella. Nice to meet you. Oh. Hey, fellas. Whoa, there's just like a giant cube there. Deal with the giant cube then. You, my man. can do this. Get a bit of this up. Bit of coal. It will make it to the next stagger before it's defeated. Let's go. There we go. Is there anything this way? Oh no, it's just a statue. I could see like a golden light. I was like, is that something that I need to worry about? I thought it was like bodies. Yet. We still have plenty of tower to explore. Yeah, it's probably been like growing, hasn't it? It's just like spreading its its essence. Which is just yuck. Okay, there's definitely a boss up from it. Oh. Hopefully they're still alive because they're idiots, but I don't want them to die. Third time's a charm, maybe. Well, look who it is. Whoa, that guy looks uh, creepy as all hell. Court 
Defense systems engaged. Initiating oh, that's another pistol line. What the hell is he talking about, Joshua? He doesn't know. Move. 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 <gasps> oh, thank God. Oh, God. The dude dodged. Excellent. Oh, fuck. Okay. He's not dead, dead. Could we get involved now, please? Can we just not just be standing there, please? Thank you. Hey, over here. Oh. I'm the more dangerous one. You come to me. You come to me. Take your friend and get out of this place now. We still like blocking the entrance, though. He's he's good. He got up. God, the the four of us just slow walking is a pretty cool image. Hey fella, Sigma. That's good. We want to say angry. I failed completely there. Dodge! Dodge me! Just, you know, wait for it to hit four and then we can unleash it. Haha, <laughs> we got there. And diamond dust as well. Come back here, dude. Mega fly up here. Oh, 
dude. Let me live in peace, please. Let me grow my mega flag to four. Thank you. by what I assume is the exact same thing. <laughs> oh, I just need that light. How embarrassing. Get you. Could I probably attack while this was happening? Yes. But, uh,. Because especially because we get extra when we dodge the attack. Oh no. towards him. Yes. That uh, took a while, but I think that was me being annoying. <laughs> Choosing the, the very, uh, you know, hard way to do it. Because I've chosen Bahamut instead of um, Titan. I feel that um, my stagger doesn't disappear as quickly as it used to. Relocation. That's disappearing or we're disappearing? I'd say that was the heart of a mother crystal. Oh, hey fellas, you okay? I've got a few potions left over, you can use them. <laughs> I knew that fallen thing was no match for you. Allow me to apologize for earlier. That was, uh, ill played. All born of a misunderstanding, though. Can we start again? We don't need your apologies, we need answers. And you're going to give them to us. Yeah, how did you get in? I uh, suppose you'll be wanting to know about the tower then. As you've probably guessed, this isn't the first time we've been here. Fact is, my people have been coming to this place for centuries. Centuries? Have they now? To these ruins in particular? Aye, well, they uh, talked to us, told us what this lot was all for. And what is it for? Well, believe it or not, the Fallen were actually using this place to make their own, uh, mother crystal. Yep. Though, despite years of searching, all we ever found was shards. Then, Harpocrates was right. 
it would seem that the Fallen did indeed acquire the gods' ability to craft crystals. I mean, not very good ones. I wouldn't go that far. The shards aren't exactly divine. They're not even what you'd call But decent. what would have happened if you'd, you know, got in chances afterwards? Nothing, and nothing is what our you know, had you'd, before what I'm trying to say is, you know, so if they'd had the chance to develop them further. But these dust crystals have only recently appeared on the black market. What made you decide to start selling them? The skies. Once they went dark, the crystals started growing back till there were more than you could count. And with the mothers all cracked, anyone with anything that could muster so much as a spark had people queuing up to take their coin. Yes, at a cost to us all. Quality apart, these crystals are no different from the ones the world has been using since the dawn of time. <laughs> And it cannot continue. No. It cannot. While this is clearly none of Ultima's doing, there can be little doubt but that it serves his cause. Then our path is clear. So let's do what must be done. Wait. You don't aren't thinking what I think you're thinking. Are you? Yep. Oh. I think there's a good chance we are. We're gonna go destroy the but, crystals. Uh, what about what about the tower's defenses? That thing you just fought, it won't be the last one. And the further you climb, the worse they'll get. How about we head back to Martha's before someone gets hurt, eh? That is sound advice. You go first. Which I suggest you take. We follow later after we've done our business here. Hurt. 